you should have maintained the same knuckle count as you establish at address. By that I mean whatever you saw at address, you'll still see the same knuckle count when you get to step three. I got this idea from watching so much videotape and observing how the left arm worked into step three positioning. Your left wrist should not over rotate or twist, which would add knuckles, put your knuckles straight up at the sky. Nor should it curl under too much, which would subtract knuckles. So that knuckle count is a solid idea. Either of these wrist actions can cause the club face to close or open excessively off plane in the swing. It's an idea that gives students an easy checkpoint, and I highly recommend using it.